Hello everyone, my name is Odinson and this is Total War Warhammer 3. Um, we have the SFO mod installed, Storm of Chaos, and this is a Scarbrand Immortal Empires campaign, episode 8. Alright, let's jump back in. Things are still in the balance here, we're not OP or anything, we're not anywhere close to being the strongest faction on the map, we don't own the most land. We've had two army wipes. We're having problems with lizard men and dwarves and orcs right now. We've done pretty well against the orcs. But I think they're in a bit of a battle with the um, other dwarves to the northeast at the moment. So um, we're going to see where this goes. Okay, yeah, so he's here. We saw this guy. These beastmen here we don't really care about right now. This guy is making his journey north. We've got a 15 stack there. They took back this somehow. But we're going to burn that down again. <clears throat> and then once we've done that... In fact, I think I just want to burn these. To, I mean, it depends how much property they've got. They've got all this. These three and that. As far as I could tell, and then them two there. This is their capital city now. I don't know. We've got 9,000 skulls. Campaign move for 25 after it. So income from post battle by control plus five. Two blood hosts. Okay. We've got bother the boys, bother the boys. Okay. We've got two blood hosts. Uh, we should probably look at what we got here. Yeah, he's good. But, um, Egrim, you need some stuffs, boy. Alright, talisman. Weapon. Armor and an enchanted item. There we go. And we'll give you some ancillaries. Give you that. That. And that's all we can give you for the moment, but it's better than nothing. I mean, diplomatic rations plus 10, casualty replenishment, campaign line of sight. And these are all individual, but um, he's all right. Okay, that's good. All right, let's enter, end the turn. Yeah, they're going to clear us out of this side, I think. He's going to go up there and support them. Yep. Okay. Interesting. Alright. Thorak, what are you up to? Oh, it would be nice if you took on the lizard, man. You're running away? Alright. Really? Are you that dumb? Okay. 
Legion of the Gore Queen. What are you gonna do? Seriously? That's really sucky. I'm gonna have to deal with that now. Hello. Okay. Uh, we'll let the money build up. Oh, we got our hero back. Hello, bro. Alright. Let's go. We're going to sit in there. Not sure what you're gonna do. Is Malekith himself? Hit the lizard man. Yes. That's good. Okay. Want them two to fight each other. Not sure what you're up to, bro. Wow, they took Iron Frost. Hmm, not really, mate. You just took one of the properties I wanted. <clears throat> okay. Let's see, shall we? Decisive, get out. I'm gonna skulls. Thank you. shall we? All right. Hmm. We're going to stick you in that mode and we're going to send you up there. Because that way you don't take the damage. Good. And then we're going to have to come and deal with these guys, unfortunately. How many properties have these guys got left? Seven. Two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So that is all their properties, basically. I think we kind of have to wipe them, don't we?
Yep, I think we have to wipe them. Corn corruption, skulls gained from kills. It's 10,000 skulls. Okay. Good. I think we're good. Yeah, he's moving over there. If we can take him out, we will. Just because, like, they're a pain in the fucking ass. <clears throat> Karak Eight Peaks is going to be a problem. Skaven in there. Okay, um, and we were looking at them, but we I didn't pay attention to. Yeah, they've still got armies there somewhere. I'm not sure what they're doing, but they've definitely got armies there. <clears throat> they're not as strong as they were. They're still strong. And we're stronger than these, allegedly, so we should definitely deal with these boys ah. all right I am brow what are you doing Not sure what he's doing, to be honest. These guys are doing. Causing problems with Nagaron, that's what they're doing. Alright bro, what are you up to? running you better run pirates okay yeah yeah Eric but no losses and then we're going to occupy that one Because then we want to spread to there, so we're going to... Wait, what? Interesting. Gonna give it control. There are definitely rats around here somewhere. Okay. Ah, here we go. 10, 19. Here he is. All right. Now we know what the crack is. We're going to get him stronger. A lot of melee, but... We could probably... Hit another one of these, but which one, which one? Alright, speed. 
control plus one. What is this? Entities can't die. Souls collected from skull plus web strength plus ten from orders, warriors, knights and chosen a corn, yeah. Perfect figure unbreakable. Bloodhurst plus one turns to initial bloodthirst attrition. Armor plus ten. Hmm. Income from sacking. Baneshi. Bonus versus large. Chaos Furies. Okay. Taken of corn. Yeah. Ha! Huh. I mean, I'm kind of thinking this one. Indeed. All right, Scarbrand. Yep, kill for corn. Passive. Nice. He's look good. Um, that's the casualty replenishment. And holy resilience, wound recovery time. Plus 30 for this lord. That's pretty strong. Okay. It's a whole bunch. Fuel by range. Rage. That's going to be good. We've already got the missiles. I mean, I guess we hit up. No, I think we just need to. Oh, choices. I think getting Scarbrand himself stronger is going to be good because. Range of Chrono. An active ability means that gives rampage. Then that opens up these. Sure. Melee attack plus one hundred percent. Turns his physical resistance that enabled a fifty. Oh, it's a passive. Hit points less than fifty percent means he doubles his damage output. Holy crap. Okay, yeah. That's a rampage. That means you are drinker of blood. Heal per second plus 0.1%. Plus 0.1%. Okay. But that. And then these. We can make him break it basically un unbeatable. <clears throat> okay. Let the slaughter commence. Hey, who the hell is this guy? Oh, this is the blood host, isn't it? Yeah. Gifts of corn. Oh no, it's this guy. Lord of War. Egrim. Okay, so he got some skill points. Okay, cool. Um, Alright, so he's going to be at 19. He's a 20 stack. They've got 30. Going to be a battle. Going to be a battle. Yes, take on the dwarves. Gonna mess you up. I mean, you'll probably win, but it's gonna mess you up in the process. Hello, Wicket. Oh, why do they hate us now? What the hell, dude?
All right, screw you. Our only friend. Nice. Did you just take out? Wow. Where did they go? Probably worrying. you doing you div yeah go has hustle them province secured western badlands stone mine tower so we spread perfect so we own that region now that's actually really good okay uh control actually we're really good on control corruption probably uh we don't need to build them anymore so we can start i mean i guess what are these? Spawn of corn, okay. Uh, Chaos Warriors. Yeah, let's do that. Okay. And that one needs to be rebuilt when that's done. All right, we good. You need a couple more turns. I mean, we can probably, we can afford it. All right. We can't afford to rebuild it yet. All right, keep healing, bruh. I mean, this is starting to look better now. But we just need to deal with these guys. These four properties here, plus... Also... Yeah, look, he's fighting up here. He's probably sending his armies up here. To the wisdom of Valea. They're a version of us. They just. Only true vengeance will make I mean, we're close, but we're not that close. <clears throat> okay, well, I guess we keep fighting them. Yeah, I know. It's only three turns. All right, that's perfect. Uh, end turn. Yeah, see, this is what I think. I think the orcs are going to burn themselves on this, and I think Thorak here is going to be in big trouble if he keeps messing with me like this. Oh, guys, I mean, they're going to get burned down. We 
could be in a position to take advantage of the fact that they're all fighting each other right now. Don't care about you, mate. Okay, last defenders just did that. All right, that's good to know. Um, right, so we need to rebuild that four turns, and then we can do the spread thingy. I think you, even though you're not healed yet, need to um, get into heal mode <clears throat> and just start moving. Same with you, bro. Get into heal mode. Start moving. All right. All right. Infernus. Uh, assassinate. Failed again. <clears throat> More skulls. More skulls. Oh, control here is bad. Uh, let's not worry about that for now. Let's get some control in. Uh, we need to deal. I mean, this is going to spread all the way down here. All down these jungles, probably. The Abyssal, Glacier, Demonium Coast. Okay. Sword of Cain is sat there. Alright. Let's see what happens. These ogres are another factor. Alright, if you pull some shit here, you're gonna lose everything you own. Oh, dude, really? These guys I would kind of like to make friends with, but just nobody likes us, <laughs> basically. You're going after the ogres. Should be going after the orc. Oh, it's Belagar. He jumped the wall, that's good. Okay. Oh yeah, they got nailed. Look, they lost most of their power. Okay, we're wiping them. Got an opportunity. More one, but we got an opportunity. Goals there, bro. Pirates. Okay, scheme of doom. So they've done a special warlock. Harvester's pride down. Nice, extra skulls. My bruh. Yeah, 
we need to wipe these guys was like the whole strike while the iron is hot type deal. Three turns on that. I think we might need to go across to that way. Yeah, five percent chance to automatically colonize. Yeah, 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 yeah. <clears throat> Our income ain't great, but. Need to do that. That. That's fine. No build and upgrade. Hero. Failed again. All right. That brings us to the end of the turn and the end of this episode. So thank you very much for watching as always. And until next time, please do stay safe out there.